Hello everyone. Today I am here with uh, um, something about the WMS. In the last video, I also prepared a video about uh, WMS and how to uh, uh, get the data from the WMS in our QGIS uh, platform. Now um, we are trying to get the WMS, uh, that is web map service, uh, URL and get the images from the WRL into uh, our um, and save it in our uh, storage so in, in the similar way we can also have the same concept uh, to store the uh, google satellite images maybe so uh, we can use for that but now for now i am going to use um, one of the links uh, which has uh, different maps yeah so there is a wms map so here is a plan for the city which i have already uh, shown you in the last video so i'm going to use this wms service and store this uh, data into our directory so for that uh, first i will go here and inspect the element and then go to the network and when i reload it the wms will be reloaded yeah so here are some you can see some dark places so in the same way i can see the map uh service of the wms service of this uh one of the uh tile yeah so i'm going to use this tile to store into my directory so what i would do is copy this one and, and i have prepared a code for this which is OWS lib WMS. So you have to first install install the OWS. Mm -hmm. Where was that? I have see. Yeah, in the in the terminal or no? In the history. Oh, no. Yeah, in the you have to install pip install OWS lib to use the service, and after that, uh, uh, import matplotlib for the um, image uh, for your uh, displaying of the images, um, it, and then uh, you can use the WMS URL here, which I have copied before. So I will just paste WMS URL up to the WMS, and I will just remove this all these things okay and after that uh, the wms will be converted wms will be layer will be connected using the web map service which is the uh, service from the w ows lib library and the crs will be 3857 so i will look at this uh, parameter here wms so uh, here the layer is ala uh, Skirer LF. So I will copy this one and it's in the layer name here. Okay. And then I will go into the last and the height and width will be 256 by 256 and EPSC will be 3857. Yeah. And the bounding box is given here. So I will also copy this bounding box to save the same image. Yeah. So we can use this in the bounding box. So I will paste it here and the width and height will be the same and the image format will be image and PNG format and the parameter will be used here and uh, map that request that read uh, and we'll write uh, into our uh, directory. Yeah. So I will just uh, run this first, run this again and then I have to run this W web map service. And if that is without error, I, yeah, it's without error. And then layer name and CRS bounding box with height image format. And we will just store this, um, around this all and it's already uh, run i think yeah and then when i save these images into my file 
I can see uh, the it is stored in here. So the last object is two one. So when I see the map, I can see this uh, layer here. So in this way, we can store the all the uh, tiles that are present in this WMS layer. When we use a, a range of the bounding box and yeah, and the range of the layer name, we can store all. We can uh, tell all the layer name uh, that is present in this WMS service, and we we can give a range of bounding box here to store the image. So in this way, we can also uh, display this here. So this way we can store the map that is from the server into our directory and save into our directory. So this much for today. So, okay. And see you next time.